There's so much noise out there today for people telling you that they can 10X your business overnight or they can add $50,000 of new income every month. You only have to work four days and they can get that done for you in the next 90 days. It's a bunch of crap. There is no magic bullet when you're building a business. I don't care if you're a solopreneur, a business coach, a tax professional, wealth manager, whatever you are, or a bigger business, you, it doesn't work. There's no magic to it. You have to have the essential components in place in order to build your business consistently with identifiable processes. And I'm going to tell you about the five that if you have these, and these are the only ones you have, but you get these integrated, connected, and running smoothly, you are going to get results. Number one is your elevated personal brand. You gotta have this. It just isn't an option anymore today because people are checking you out. Your prospects and clients are making value judgments about you based on what they see, and it's really easy to check you out today with platforms like LinkedIn. So they're looking at you and they're making decisions. Should I get on a phone call with this person, let alone buy their product or service? So you have to elevate your brand, and LinkedIn's checking you out with your brand, and they're scoring you, one to 100. One, one you suck, 100, you're great, it's called your social selling index. And so if you're, if you're not doing the right things with your personal brand on LinkedIn, they're gonna push you down to make you irrelevant. So Brand, your brand is huge. Maybe you're the founder of a company and you're the face of the company. You're not doing the direct selling, but you're the face of the company. You need to be out there with an elevated brand that helps the cause. Or if you're doing the direct selling, for sure, you want to make sure your brand is elevated because people are checking you out and you want to control your story. You don't want people to make judgments about you that are incorrect because you may never even get the phone call because they look at you and you look crappy, you don't have your A game on, you wouldn't do that in real life at a real life networking event, you'd go there and you'd look you know, sharp, why would you not do that on platforms like LinkedIn? So number one, elevate your personal brand. Number two is you need to have a video content strategy. And this is just no longer a choice, it's mandatory. Video has exploded, the stats are out there, your prospects and your clients want to learn about you, your story, your product, your service, by watching a video. And you know there just is, is no option not to include this today because the conversions are so much better for everything when you're using video. For people to get on a phone call with you, to attend an event, certainly to buy your product or service, it's video, video, video. YouTube, second most visited website on the planet next to Google, and, and, and YouTube is exploding, we know this. And so it's video, video, video. You need to understand how to do this. It's not about spending a ton of money going buying all this fancy equipment. If you do it right, it works, your conversions go up, and now you are head and shoulders above everybody else because most, the vast majority, are not doing video even today. And so you need to have a video strategy when it comes to your content, know how to repurpose that video. So that's number two. Number three, you gotta do lead generation. And lead generation is something, it doesn't matter if you're Coca-Cola or a solopreneur, you gotta sell and selling's hard, otherwise we'd all be experts at it, but you have to do this in the right way. Lead generation isn't about cramming products or services down people's throats, and you have to just build your community. So it's about targeting the right people, developing your niche, understanding who you wanna serve, then understanding the language you need to use to speak to those people, and delivering that language through lead generation and connecting with them, bringing them in to your ecosystem where they're connected with you and they're getting your, your valuable content and you're doing all the things to nurture those people but you've gotta run these lead generation campaigns and you've gotta figure out automation, scaling, because there's great tools there available to all of us to make this efficient. You can't escape it. So lead generation, about community build, right people, messaging, getting them into your sales funnel, making them aware of who you are, then generating interest and in learning more, and then call to action, right, the next step of the funnel to get them on a Zoom, where then you can get them into the pipeline and convert. And lead generation is about building up 
the fat pipeline. You can't expect to just close everybody right away. You need to have a big fat pipeline. So your lead gen's gotta be identifiable, repeatable, ongoing, consistent, and you need to be having discussions every single month with the right people. So that's number three. Number four is you gotta have an email nurture campaign critically important because for 90% of the people that come into your funnel, once you've made them aware of who you are, they're going to be long-term leads. You're not gonna convert them in the short term. So you have to have a way to nurture these people. And you can't talk to them one day and then five months later, you know, do nothing and then call them again because you're reaching back out. That doesn't work. They're not gonna remember you, let alone the conversation. So you have to nurture. And one great way to do it, and an essential component you gotta have is email nurture. But the email's gotta be done right. You gotta know what type of email to send out. It's gotta be valuable content. You can't just, it's not email where you're selling them all the time. And the rule of thumb really is market, 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 sell, market, 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 sell. So the email has to have the right subject line, the right content, displayed the right way. And most people don't, don't send out an email and nurture consistently. And those that do, the emails suck. And they do it the wrong way. And people are unsubscribing, they get no action, no activity, no opens, no click-throughs. So email nurture is, is important and if done the right way will bring you results and part of it is knowing how to gather emails along the way as you're reaching out and connecting to get them into your distribution platform it's a very important part of growing an email list and nurturing so the next step number five is virtual events and so there just is a killer opportunity to put on virtual events where you're building authority and engaging with the right people. These are Zoom events, you're recording them for a piece of content, you're integrating this with the LinkedIn events feature. If you do this the right way and you're consistent with it, maybe you start out doing it once every, every 60 days. You have a theme around your show and your event. Maybe you're interviewing people and or maybe you're just solo, educating, talking. But the bottom line is it's a value-based show you're putting on, branded for you, looks great, done well, and you're speaking to your audience, your audience of people that you wanna work with. What do they wanna hear about? What do they care about? Well, you're bringing that content to them. So you're not pounding people, asking them to do something. Join my group, buy this, sign up for that. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about bringing value to your audience through these virtual events. And so you package those up and you market them the right way and you have a real opportunity to stand out and do something very few are doing. So those are your five essential components. If you put those together and that's what you do, you integrate them and they're all talking to each other, working as one for the common goal, you are going to see results. So stop listening to people that are telling you they're gonna 20X your business overnight and bring you 50 grand of new income next month, every month, and you're gonna be working three days a week from some beach somewhere. Ain't gonna happen. Thanks.